Ocean currents are like large rivers in the ocean, flowing predictably either near the surface or deep within. They vary in size, some short and others spanning thousands of miles across the ocean. Wind, Earth's rotation and water density are the three primary forces driving ocean currents. The patterns of winds and variations in water density are closely associated with Earth's temperature. The increase in global temperature is significantly impacting the ocean current system. The Atlantic Ocean Current, an intricate system of warm and cold currents crucial for regulating temperatures in Europe and North America, is showing signs of weakening or collapsing. What could happen if the Atlantic Ocean Current collapsed? The Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation also known as the Atlantic Conveyor Belt, is a large system of ocean currents that plays a critical role in regulating Earth's climate. It circulates hot and cold water throughout the Atlantic Ocean. When the sun warms the waters near the equator, winds push this warm water northward. As it moves, it cools and becomes denser. This denser, colder water sinks near Greenland and the Labrador Sea, forming deep water currents. These currents then travel southward along the ocean floor, bringing cold water back toward the equator. This ongoing movement of warm and cold water helps control global temperatures by spreading heat from the equator to the poles. The Atlantic Current helps moderate temperatures between two extreme points. Global warming is seriously affecting the natural flow of ocean currents. The rising global temperature is melting the Greenland ice sheet, adding fresh water to the North Atlantic. Since fresh water is less dense than ocean water, it disrupts the ocean currents. This influx of fresh water on the surface makes the water less dense, potentially weakening the circulation. The global increase in ocean temperature is affecting water density, which is crucial for generating water currents based on density variations. This circulation of warm and cold water helps balance global temperatures by moving heat from the equator to the poles. The weakening of Atlantic Ocean currents could have disastrous effects in Europe and North America. Without the influx of warm air and water, Europe could face severe winters. The absence of a circulatory system that regulates temperatures at extreme points could impact weather patterns, potentially resulting in more extreme weather events. Scientists have found indications that the Atlantic current system is exhibiting signs of collapse. Calculations suggest that the current system has slowed down. Temperature plays a crucial role in regulating this system, but predicting the complete shutdown of the system is difficult and cannot be accurately forecasted. 